In the past 30 minutes, sources confirmed. Today, Donald Trump asked Indiana Governor Mike Pence to be his running mate. Pence is believed to be on a plane right now to New York City. The official announcement is set for tomorrow morning in the city. And Channel 2's Richard Elliott, live in Midtown Atlanta, with the information Trump revealed on the Herman Cain Show. Donald Trump called into Herman Cain's show on WSB radio this morning. While he would not say specifically who his pick was going to be, he did offer some hints that it was going to be Mike Pence and not George's Newt Gingrich. Mr. Donald Trump, presumptive Republican nominee, welcome to the Herman Cain show. On his radio show, Herman Cain asked Donald Trump about the process of selecting a vice presidential nominee. Trump mentioned Chris Christie and George's Newt Gingrich. But he offered glowing praise for Indiana Governor Mike Pence. You know, Chris Christie's been a great friend of mine, and Newt has been a great friend. Governor Pence has done such an incredible job in Indiana. You know, you look at what's happened out there, it's really like a miracle state. And just minutes after that interview, rumors started circulating that Pence was indeed the choice. Trump's Georgia campaign director even tweeted out, Pence, hashtag RNC 2016. At 2 o'clock, Newt Gingrich himself took a Facebook Live and while not offering any clues, he admitted Pence might be a safer choice to appease some of the anti-Trump delegates. I told him quite directly that I thought that he had a choice between having two pirates on the ticket or having a pirate and a relatively stable, uh, more normal person. Democratic strategist Theron Johnson sees the choice of Pence as a safe one for Trump. I think as we go into the convention, this is a move that, quite frankly, Donald Trump knew that he had to bring someone that can kind of ease the uh, angst and the uh, resistance that Donald Trump is facing right now. And Trump will make his final decision public tomorrow morning at 11 o'clock. We'll let you know what it is. We're live in Midtown, Richard Elliott, Channel 2 Action News.